So let's connect the Terraform to AWS by adding the IAM user to Terraform configuration. Open the VS Code. That is it. Open the folder first deployment. Open the file providers TF. And here I create something like provider AWS. Here I write region. I want the provider to work in my region. I already told you that I'm close to Frankfurt. So I will deploy resources into Frankfurt. Past it, EU Central 1. But you can also use your regions. It doesn't matter. Select the region you want and use it. Now the access key. Access key equals empty string. And secret key, which also equals an empty string. Let's populate it. Go to AWS. That's my user, security credentials, scroll down to access keys, create access key, select the first one, command line interface, select the checkbox, next, no description, create access key. The access key was created, I copy the access key, paste it here. I copy the secret key, paste it here. So I have the access key and secret key. It means Terraform now knows how to connect to AWS and knows to which AWS account to connect. So this part is ready. Every element is configured. Let's go to AWS. I'm going to click done. I have a message that I must save the secret key because there is no possibility to retrieve it in the future. Continue. Here is the access key. It is also here. In case you lose your access key, you just delete the current one and create a new one. Go to VS Code. I want to commit my changes, but very important, these credentials, they shouldn't go to a repository. So, temporary, I will just delete them. I have this empty provider. I go to commits. I check the changes. I see that I added a provider for the Frankfurt region. I add the file to the stage. Close the working tree and write the commit message. Edit AWS credentials new line connect terraform to aws commit and push very good it was pushed to the main branch on github let's check on github that i didn't push my credentials that's my account that is the repository. And here is the provider without access key and secret key. Let's pass back the access key and the secret key. That's the secret key. And that is the access key.